Here's where I came from. That's where the cars park. I remember coming up here a couple years ago with Mom to get some of the ones that Kenny put out. This place has changed so much, like all the trees are gone. This is where the one was that I just found. It's called Corners. It's up that little trail right there. Underneath a downed log. Now I'm going to the next one. I can't remember what it's called though. Something about in the woods. More stuff in the woods. More things in the woods. But I can't tell where I'm going though. It's 507 down there. Yeah, it's down that road. Yeah, there we go. We're on the right track now. Sun came out. It's actually a pretty day. It uh, poured down rain on me when I was coming out here. Kind of gross. There's a can to pick up when I come back out. I'm getting, trying to get it, um, maybe three of these today. How, how much has this changed? This should be all trees. Not that long ago. It's kind of sad. But I know that's what they do out here. They grow trees and cut them down. There's the big stump. And there's the cat. Welcome to the next one. The calls are starting to get kind of creepy. But we're going to try to get two more. Maybe one more if we're lucky. Somebody lost a shirt. We have about a quarter of a mile to the next one. And I guess uh, Bev called, or yeah, Bev called Warehouser, and I guess they're uh, going to close this area to everybody starting August 1st. So I'm trying to get the all these before August 1st. Uh, they're going to require you to buy a permit. I think she said 100 and 50 bucks or something like that for hunters to come out here and hunt so if that's the case all the geocaches that are up here will have to be removed which is kind of sad because this is kind of a really neat area and it's close to home um yeah kind of sad but how it is i guess keep people from coming up here and Stealing things and making messes, throwing garbage up here, illegally shooting things. So, yeah. Alright, till the next one. Here's the location of the next one. Here's a 360 view. And there's the cat. It's a yellow golf ball. Woot. Alright, this is where we came to. Pretty awesome view of some trees. This is called Holy something. Hold on. Holy Camo Oli. And there's a tree that has been really heavily damaged by woodpeckers. I thought it was here, because I saw how people had circled the tree. Then I saw this, and looked down in there, and there it is. 
So go me. Oh. All right, now to the next one. That was about 30 feet off for me. We can kind of see where, like, the geo trail, so I kind of just followed it. It hasn't rained yet, so that's good. So we don't want it to. This is where my pants kind of kind of got wet. And we're going to be off to the next one here. If I remember. A lookout point two three. I don't know if that's what this is. Okay. Four things in the woods. Oh no, no. If we're off to the next we're one. On our way to the next one. Lots of dense forest and they haven't cut down. But it's probably on the plan for next time. Unfortunately. And there's, what is that, a door? Oh no, it's a piece of metal that people come out here and shoot. How mature. No wonder they want to close this thing down. People litter, probably grab that on the way back too. It's actually really nice when it's not raining. Pretty pleasant walk. It is uh, 0.15 to the next cache, which is called Lookout. I can't remember who it's by. Crystal Crypter. Bob and Lars found it. First to find it. And the cords are wrong. Oh. I will have to look at that. Look at the log. Oh, they have been corrected, sweet. Kind of worried. And the hint is under sheet, the small. Sweet. Channel 27. Alright. There's the cash. Guess we got the letters on it. So it's inside. Oh, it's in Taco Crack. Hmm. Put a golf ball in it. Hmm. I'm going to use their pen so I don't have to get it out of my pocket. So quite a few people have been up here. Starting to rain, so that's nice. I'll have to hook it back so we can get back in the car. I'm gonna go do my chores. It's not cold, it's just rainy. Good, I forgot to put the camera Sometimes there's a bugger to get closed. That's when our lid is broken. Makes it tough. Alright, here we go. Not bad. Now it's starting to rain. Kind of sad. Thought I'd be able to get all the ones that I had planned without it raining, but yay, washing in the spring. Um, I'm not really sure how far of a walk I have, probably a little over a mile back to the car. Which I can, you know, bust that out pretty quickly. 
most of it's going to be downhill once I get up this, this little hill right here. But, yeah, kind of lame. Really hate spring in Washington. It's just gross. But, what are we going to do? Another little fun hill. It's kind of out in the clearing now. It stopped raining a little bit. It's still kind of sprinkly, but it's not coming down really hard like it was earlier. Picked up a, two cans along the way. I think there's maybe two more that are visible. Probably tons of them out here that I don't even see. But, yeah. Can't wait till it's summertime. It's gonna be awesome.